lack of coordination is one of the major challenges for implementing IWM in our country. And that is not just being able to bring the right stakeholders to the table, but being able to bring the right people to the table. And not just bringing them for dialogue, but bringing them for meaningful collaboration and meaningful action. The degree to which water-related regulations are enforced and there is insufficient engagement on the civil society and community level. The principal issues in the development of the integration of the resources of water in Cuba are fundamentally dados by the access to technologies, from the monitoring to the own gestion of the services. In the same way, the low levels of treatment of water residuals influence the development of the gestion. Priority, um, I don't think it's a priority for the legislature currently. Um, historically also, it's been generally difficult to promote and sustain interagency cooperation, even intergovernmental agencies cooperation. Um, NGOs are in a decline. Um, it'd be very difficult to get, to get NGOs on board. I believe that um, the, the main issue related to IWRM in the Federation of St. Kitts and Nevis is the lack of a, a coordinating entity, an entity that can coordinate and facilitate IWRM across multiple agencies. I think that's really lacking here. Possibly the lack of awareness of the role of citizens in implementing IWRM, as well as a lack of a program, comprehensive program, which would bring out the critical importance of IWRM in mitigating climate change impacts. Is a documentation of how countries in the CARICOM region, countries that have similar cultures, are implementing IWM. What are their challenges and what are their solutions? And a documentation of those success stories. And that would help us to develop, to look at models of, of what is working and be able to tailor those models to the benefit of implementing better water resources management in each of our islands. I'm looking forward to see how wastewater will feature in this document. The development of the Marco Regional Action Caricom will provide solutions to common problems in a community of collaboration and participation. De igual manera, contribuirá a la formación de capacidades resilientes y sostenibles en el área del Caribe. Clear guidance, clear policies that are ad adaptable to different countries. That would be great that we could probably just blend it into our, 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 our um, legislation. Sharing of, of knowledge, of lessons learned, and teasing out, you know, what are the best practices um, that really work um, in our region and trying to implement those and again sharing um, you know all along that process of implementing and facilitating IWRM. I hope to see more sharing of experiences coming from the action plan that has been developed by GWPC.